What's going on, ladies and gentlemen? Dan here. Welcome back to USC 2 Career Mode. We're moving on. Let's see what kind of fight offers we have. I'm actually not sure where they want me to go with this. Top contender. I can fight Dalloway again. I've already fought him once. I knocked him the fuck out. Uh, have ever, I haven't fought DeBoer. These guys are all lower than me, so I'll be in the red corner. But the thing is, I knocked this guy out so fast. It was pretty fantastic. Um... But he's number five, so I, I'm going to do what's going to get me the most fans right now. So I don't know. The thing is, I don't know when I'll be able to get my title shot. What I'm going to do, actually, is... Oh, I cannot train stand-up. Thanks. Okay, that's fine. Another heated... You guys have so many agreements. Get a new stand-up coach, then. Fuck. All right, I'm going to spend some of those uh, per or points on uh, some, maybe some move upgrades. Maybe get my punches upgraded, because they're pretty weak right now. I, I don't really use those, but maybe get my jab upgraded. Stiff jab. No, nah, regular jab is better. Get that level three. Just because I do that a lot. So let's try the straight then. Let's look for the straight. There we go, straight cross. We'll get that upgraded to a level three. Just because those are our basics. I should probably do the hooks too. Hey, I do hooks pretty often. Lead hook. Oh no, I don't have any more points. All right, well, we've upgraded our hooks a little bit. I wasn't expecting to use them all up that fast, but that's okay. All right, let's go into um, getting our training camp going. So I can only work the clinch and the ground training. So if I end up getting my... Oh, you're a dick, you know that? Look where it's starting me. It reset the whole thing. That is some bollocks right there. Because I want to get that toughness up a bit. It's only at a 50, which is pretty pathetic. Maybe get my uh, on the back a little bit higher up. And then switch on back to the clinch. And get that last upgrade point. Right? I think that's probably our best bet. Let's take a look at this, actually. We ended up getting a, a medium, and I'm going to do it just so we can get that next uh, stamina boost. And get the takedown defense is important. Now that I, I can properly do it, oh, I got some clinch grappling dropped by 10. That's pretty shit. Considering my clinch is already pretty bad anyway. But that's okay. This guy's not going to really be doing too many clinches, I don't think. Last time I fought him, I knocked him out relatively quickly. So... Still in the top main card. Dalloway. He's got such a huge head, man. I cannot tell you. So that's why it's putting me as home. Because I'm in the red corner. Even though I'm not. I guess we'll do away tonight. 17 wins, though. That's pretty remarkable. Coming up next. It's a middleweight matchup between the gentleman and CB. The Doberman Dalloway. All right, back in Japan for another great match, hopefully. Nice fight. CB Dalloway, as always, very well prepared and extremely focused and ready to go to battle. This guy has tremendous ground technique and his ability to pass guard and get to a dominant position is elite. CB Dalloway steps inside the octagon, ready to do battle. See, the thing is, he's a pretty tall dude, but his legs look kind of smaller compared to, like, his head. So it's just, like, big head and then at normal, normal, normal. You know what I mean? It's just, it looks kind of funny. The gentleman makes his way out of the tunnel and is set to enter the octagon. 
So I just realized you come out barefoot. I hope One they disinfect them. One thing for from him is his low kicks. He throws them with devastating power. And if you can't defend against them, he will kick the legs right out from under you. It doesn't take too many before you start to lose speed and punching power. Yeah, ground and pound is very important in this, that's for sure. The gentleman said to go to bat with CB, the Doberman Dalloway. Our tale of the tape for this middleweight fight. Dalloway is six years his elder. He will have a five-inch reach advantage. Got a lot of and height advantage, again, but... Here's Bruce Buffer. That don't matter, though. Ladies and gentlemen, this fight is three rounds in the UFC middleweight division. It's Lucy Burson. Fighting in the A mixed martial artist holding a professional record of 20 wins, 12 losses. He stands 6 feet 2 inches tall, weighing in at 185 pounds. Fighting out of Tempe, Arizona, USA, CB, the Doberman, the and now it's Lucy's opponent, fighting out of the red corner. A Taekwondo fighter, holding a professional record of 17 wins, no losses. He stands six feet tall, weighing in at 185 pounds. Fighting out of Edmonton, Alberta, Canada, the gentleman. And the For their next game, they should probably import a few more names, you know what I mean? So that they can actually Dan say your name. Liotta, our referee. If you're lucky enough to have one of those names, in Tokyo, Japan. Here we go. good on you, mate. Our fight tonight is scheduled for three five-minute rounds. Black trunks for Dalloway, white trunks for the gentleman. Joey has worked his way up the ladder, and tonight faces the most difficult Whoa, keep your hands test up. of his mixed martial arts career. He said he wants to fight the best. Well, tonight he gets that opportunity. He's doing a great job of timing these shots. Oh! Powerful knee to the headland. Oh! That's it. Oh my God! Two flying knees. Unbelievable! Beautiful knee here early in the first. Let's check out the action on our fight replay. Two knees. Boom! That drops them. Woo, I love that. He's clearly hurt badly here. Let's take a look at it from another angle here. Oh! This is the one that causes the knockdown and the subsequent follow-up strikes for the knockout. Great angle here. Bam! Nighty night. Yeah, he's napping. Once again, Dalloway is done. All right, here's Bruce Buffer with the decision. Ladies and gentlemen, referee Dan Mergliata has called a stop to this contest at 56 seconds in the very first round. Damn. The winner by I gotta get those 30 second the trophy. The gentleman. Winner by knockout. Another great fight. I wonder who's going to take me on next. I love fighting Dalloway, man. He's a quick knockout. How come I don't get performance of the night? Mine was quick. 56 seconds, round one. Oh, yeah. There we go. Longevity's been increased. We get 2,000 experience. We're a superstar now. Look where the retirement is, though. That's pretty remarkable. I thought it would go up a little higher than that. But it was before that tick last time. So we got to get another round of fighters. Hopefully we'll make it in time. But you got to get fans faster than you can. Or else you'll be too old for fighting. So, anyway, that's a good chunk of skill points to obtain. Okay, so another successful fight. Still, I still, I'm still holding my top contender spot. I don't know who's up next. Oh, I was just answered. The champion himself is right in his prime. Oh, yeah, he's staggered. He's got fantastic athleticism and just has that air of future champion. Luke Rockhold is battering Leota Machida here. This is really a showcase of just how high level his jiu-jitsu is. He's tapping. It's all over. Luke Rockhold. 
I'm the best out here, and I'll prove it anytime I have to. I'm the number one contender. Now you're the champ, bro. So we actually are we is it an actual championship fight? It is, it's a title fight, it's a big one. Evade or deny all submission attempts from the ground, get into full mount. Finish Luke by submission. Well, we know we're not going to do that. But this, he's a kickboxer. This is in, this is the title fight. Title, super fight challenge, Luke Hold title fight. Wow, okay. This is crazy. Well, I got to get, I got to get to training. I got to get my training in. See how it resets it? That's what bothers me every time now. It seems to reset it. See, everything here is upgraded except those two. But why does it reset it? I don't understand why it resets your training meter. I guess it's the potential to make all of those. But anyway, the next toughness, I think I got to work on my... Uh, I'm going to keep going with the takedown defense. Going to go with the medium. Hopefully we don't get injured. It's getting harder to... Uh, to upgrade these things you can you'll notice top game is really solid i think i might get my my ground game maybe i should upgrade my defenses like this because i haven't been he's a defense guy so maybe i should do that let's work on the defense here guys Let's start with an easy one, since I don't normally Let's do them. Your submission defense on point. You gotta watch that. I'm out. So you just gotta get out of the submission, that's, that's all. all right. Great job. Come oh, man. Rotate. Good. Out. Keep moving. Keep them off you. Move with them. Roll with them. Nice. That's that. I'll probably get the goal for this. Nice. Let's stay in there. That's it. We got five left. Keep pushing. Turn out of that. I'm out. Oh, he got me there. That was weird. But I'll take it. I probably could get the... The medium training for that. But those are considered early stage. Get the, the joint defense, I think, is the biggest bet here. I'm wondering if I should work on the stand-up and finish up those things. But see, we don't need the stamina anymore because it's already maxed out. That's just a waste. I mean, they're both body, so really it doesn't matter either way. Maybe go again with the on the back. That'll get me my body upgrade. So I think I'm going to go ahead and do that. Hopefully it doesn't put too much strain on me. Alright. So we're 75 with the body. The chin is a 65. Didn't the... Wasn't I higher with chin? No, I wasn't. I wasn't any higher than a chin. Which is bad. Like everything's good. Everything's pretty decent. But my chin and my toughness are just garbage. And I'm not happy about that. But I haven't had a chin upgrade in who knows how long. So... But this is the championship fight, man. The main event. My first main event. It's in Vegas. Whose bets are on the Canadian? I don't know. I'm excited. I'm an 84 overall with that last little bit. My stand-up's a 98. Well, it's because we passed the 70 mark. Our clinch is in the 70s now. The ground is almost touching 80. But our stand-up is really, really good. So, I'm excited. I'm ready to do it. For Canada, baby. This will be my 19th win if I can get it. Coming up next, it is our main event of the evening between Luke Rockhold and the gentleman. This is going to be intense. I feel like this will be my, my toughest challenge yet. But it's for the gold, guys. opportunity here tonight as he is set to enter the octagon and fight for a championship for the very first time in his mixed martial arts career. The journey has been a good one as he works his way up to the biggest fight of his professional career and an opportunity to earn a UFC belt. 
This is his first championship fight. A tremendous amount of pressure on him right now. He is the number one contender, and this is the most important fight of his life. The gentleman enters the octagon with his mind set on just one thing tonight, winning the UFC championship. All right, I feel confident, but I'm not going to take it for granted. The former Strikeforce middleweight champion, Luke Rockhold, a perfect 9-0 during his Strikeforce days. He recorded the most finishes in UFC Strikeforce history with seven. That tied him for best all-time with Kung Lee. Luke Rockhold. The champion headed to the cage right now is in the groove. He is in his prime right now. His training for this bout has been perfect. He believes he has a solid game plan, and he's ready to step in here and retain his title. He is well prepared for this contest. I believe that. Luke Rockwell set to fight the gentleman. It's going to be a good fight, I hope. We have not fought a kickboxer yet. It's been a lot of jujitsu, boxers. Our tale of the tape for this middleweight championship fight. Greco-Roman. is six years his elder. He is three inches taller. He will have a six inch reach advantage. Damn, With I am way smaller than this dude. Here is Bruce Buffer. Ladies and gentlemen, this is the main event of the evening. The action begins, our referee in charge, Dan Bergliotta. And now, this is the moment UFC fans around the world have been waiting for. Live from the MGM Grand Garden Arena in Las Vegas. <laughs> Okay, I want to get that, man. I want him to be that excited about me being a champion. This is crazy. Look at this. All right, this is from UFC Championship. I want you to warm up your hands at all times. Protect yourself at all times. And nice, clean, safe fight. Touch gloves. Back to corners. Man, there's a ton of Whoa. bad blood in this fight. They what? refuse to touch gloves. What? I would have touched gloves. Luke ready. That's some Luke cheese. Ready. Can we still touch hey, gloves? Here we go. I was just Luke trolling Luke before, buddy. Good start. Oh, that caught Big it. shots. Head kick. Whoa, nice punch. Lands a huge kick. Oh! Get him! Oh, man, I thought I had him. Keep going! He's done! Oh! Wow! What's up, Rago? TKO in the first round. Big shots landed. I had him. For our fight replay. Let's take I wasn't sure. The fight here. This is a vicious series of strikes. For Canada, baby. And pound that lead up to the TKO. We could see it here from another look. These are clean shots that are getting in over and over again, ground and pound. 
for the TKO finish. Wow. And with the official decision, here is Bruce Buffer. Just like that, he lost Ladies his title. Referee Dan Murgliata has called a stop to this contest at one minute, 11 seconds of the very first round. Declaring the winner by TKO. Gentleman. The gentleman is the new UFC middleweight champion. Ha <laughs> ha! That's 19 and 0, ladies and gentlemen. And I, I'm the champion. I love it. Come on, you think there'd be a special celebration for when you win the title, not just the generic one? There's the trophy for the champion. Performance of the night by KO. Look at that. Because it was so fast. Round one, main event. Who had money on me? <laughs> that was awesome. Oh, come on. Give me more fans than that. My longevity was boosted by quite a bit, though. Evade or deny all submission attempts from the ground. Get Honestly, we didn't even do that. He it was too quick. Oh, my God. I don't even know what's next. Wow, what a fantastic way to go out, man. An amazingly fast knockout of Rockhold. Damn, man. I think I might have called him Rockford earlier. <laughs> Whatever. It doesn't matter anymore. We are the new champion, the middleweight champion of the world in the UFC, sitting at 19-0. God damn, that's a great record. So that was awesome. I'm super excited. I guess all that's left for us to do is just fight until it's time to retire. So ladies and gentlemen, I'm going to split this video here. I really hope you guys enjoyed it. If you did... Be sure to hit that like button. Let's try and get this guy to a thousand for the championship match if possible. Do you think it's possible? I believe. Uh, also, if you really liked it, be sure to add it to your favorites. Um, if you haven't yet, be sure to follow me on my social media. Those are down below in the description. And we'll play at the end card of this video as well. Great way to get in touch with me out of so out of uh, out of YouTube. You know, great way to get advanced uh, looks, you know, sneak peeks, exclusive giveaways, things like that. Also, if you want to get yourself a t-shirt or hoodie, there's a link to my Spreadshirt shop as well in the description. So check it out if you're interested in that. But other than that, that's it for today. Great way to go out. I'm really excited. We will see you guys in the next one where we'll continue our reign as middleweight champion. Let's hand things over to Knox Hill. See you guys. Who the man with the plan? Hmm. If you feel trouble, wild and wild, no needs violent. And hit you 8,000. Wait a minute, hold that stylist style. Damn, goddamn Billy Jack. We still riding tires flat. I hear them sirens, sea shots flying. So we driving fire back. If they ain't vibing, lie with that. Got me dressed up in all black. What up? Hood up and I see them haters. Try to run with us, they gon' need inhalers. Got to breathe them hard just like Darth Vader. Players grab your respirators. Night invaders get life savored. Mass on for the shooters. Move like trash to bed and true. Got that Glock and got them woofers Just press play, I'll keep it moving Who is Knox? Still you damn fools Keep it fresh like canned food There ain't nothing we can't do So tune into that damn kill Yeah It was never, ever A game